All right, guys, and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. I completely forgot, because it was a couple of days ago. I completely forgot. I kind of gave a little bit of Toto away. Look at the state of him. I hope this doesn't bode badly for what I have yet to come. But of course, we met the Emperor, a.k.a. the Dream Visitor. This is actually the person who's been protecting me, and we just defeated those that were trying to defeat him. I wonder if we can have one more conversation before we leave this realm. Okay, it doesn't look like we can talk. Feels oh. wonderful, doesn't God, he it? made me jump. You wear it well. Yeah, I let him. I let him come all over me with his tentacles. <laughs> I'm all right. Just, I'm just gonna get out of here. Back from the astral plane to the material plane. Are you sure you want to leave? Yeah. Well, I got nothing else. So yeah, that guy that was uh, held captive there, Orpheus. Whoa, 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 where am I? Where am I and what am I doing? Oh, we're back in our campsite. Item received a mysterious artifact. Well, well, what is this? A mysterious artifact, a many-sided artifact in blackened iron engraved with pulsating runes, something stirs within. Well, isn't that the same thing as the artifact that we've been carrying around with us all this time? Uh, and I, I have no idea what this is. Guys, thanks for joining me, but I'm getting I'm getting a little lost here. I have to go and speak to the only person who wants to talk to me, Lazel. Maybe there are others, but Lazel is the first. Orpheus, Gith's only son. He lives. It is not the Gaith visitor that Vlakith would destroy and Voss would set free. It is Orpheus, the blood of the mother, the prince of the comet. The blood of the mother? Who is that exactly? Listen close. The Emperor spoke only in half-truths. For you to know the tale of Orpheus, you must know the tale of Gith and of Vlakith. Long ago... When we rose up against our gay slavers, Mother Gith made for the Hells to secure an alliance with the Archdevil Tiamat. Tiamat gifted the Githyanki our red dragons. Gith remained in the Hells, and Tiamat's envoy proclaimed Vlakith our ruler. The first Vlakith of many. It is Vlakith 157 whom my people now call Queen. 157? There were 157 of them. That's a lot of Lacketh's. Yes. Our current queen has claimed undeath and reigned for a thousand years. But it was the first whom Orpheus tried to slay. Orpheus was, is, Gith's only son. He led his mother's own honor guard in a coup against Vlakith I. It was Kithrak Voss himself who slayed the prince in vicious battle. Or so the Varshis teach us. Yet the Prince of the Comet's been with us, subdued by that repugnant Illithid. Should Orpheus go free, he would tear Vlakith's empire to pieces and build new glory from the scraps. Yeah, but I don't know if that's the right thing to do. I mean, Orpheus is supposed to... Oh, I, oh, I, I just don't know. Then Voss was right, Orpheus is the seed of Vlakith's demise. The seed? And the sower. Ooh, I like that. Every word Voss spoke, he spoke true. Orpheus is the living proof of the Queen's lies, and the living weapon that conquered our Gaith slavers. One word from his lips, and the people would doubt. Two words, and they would rage. Three words, and they would bow to the true heir. If the Githyanki are to be free, the Prince of the Comet must lead the way. Oh, look at the state of me. Why did I choose this? What on earth have I done? Ah, the Emperor's Astral Touched Tadpole promises exceptional power. Yeah, that's what I did. I went with the Emperor's Astral Touched Tadpole. <laughs> yeah, it may have exceptional power, but exceptionally bad looks. It also promises to break us beyond repair. This ossified parasite does not make us more, but less. Do you not feel the cold where once there was heat? The void where your soul once resided? Hmm. Connect with Lazel's mind. Let her feel the sense of power coursing through you, or 
With a perception roll, it's not like that, Lazelle, except the astral touched pad tadpole's power. You'll be unstoppable. I'm gonna connect with her. See what she has to think. Oh, yeah, well, that didn't work. Okay, I'm not sure I want. Uh, do I roll again? I've got some inspiration. What the hell? Let's do it. Oh, sh sugar. Okay, that was a mistake. One more. Why? Might as well. I'm not sure I really need to do this. And finally. I can feel them. The might. The vigor. The possibilities. The Elder Brain could be the harbinger of the Grand Design and the doom of the Githyanki. The end time of the Sixteen Planes will be upon us, and the Astral would be the first to fall. Very well. I will accept what this damnable Gaithrock has to offer. Yisk Githkar Tafki Crashet. That's what I was thinking. It's exactly what I was thinking. Gis 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 Tafki Crash. Yeah, me too, me too. Let's talk about Ulfius. What about him? Uh, why is he called the Prince of the Comets? The historical slates describe Orpheus as a fearsome, terrible creature. Powerful beyond measure, and enthralled by the Geich. So mad with power, he'd smash through the Githyanki Empire and deliver the shards to his illithid masters. And glowing with such psionic force that he and his red dragon blazed a trail through the skies. A lethal comet careening towards my people. Lies, of course. Vlakith spread a false image of Orpheus as monstrous betrayer, and her knights as the butchers who sliced him through. She was right to fear him, I'll grant her that. So great is the comet, it could shatter her reign. Uh, what, all right, well, why, why did Vlakith keep Orpheus alive all those millennia ago? The Emperor may be loathsome, but it's right. Orpheus can disrupt a gay hive mind. A talent like that makes the prince a powerful shield and a powerful weapon. Why destroy a weapon like that when you can contain it in a relic and keep it for yourself? Interesting. So why would she want him dead now if he's so valuable alive? A weapon is only an asset for as long as it isn't pointed at you. Good point. The means of Vlakith's own end has been ripped away from her. Better to have Orpheus killed than to risk his escape. Better to risk the rise of Illithids than let the Prince of the Comet deny her the godhood she craves. Oh god, I t I'm just so gutted my character looks like this. I really wish I'd gone back and said, no, 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 I don't want that worm inside me. That's what she said. Who were the hostile Githyanki in the prison? Orpheus' honor guard, loyal to the end. Trapped by Vlakith in the same prism holding their noble prince, fruitlessly hacking at the sphere that contains him. They see us as Geich, tadpoled husks in the Emperor's thrall. I regret their deaths, but I pledge to live as they perished, in the service of Gith's son. Wow, she, so she's siding with that. All right, um, on to Very other matters. Well. Are there any other other matters that we really need to talk about? Lazel? No, nope, we're done. Okay, let's get the hell... Oh, wait, what? What? Life pulses from within. The parasite's thoughts whisper at the edge of your mind. It wants to share itself with you. It wants to be let in. Go on. Don't be afraid. It only wants to help you evolve. I've got a bad feeling about this. Eat the tadpole. Hmm? Probe the tadpole's intentions. Oh, it's a, it's another dice roll. All right, let's try it. Ah, well, it worked. It's good. The tadpole screams for growth with painful intensity. It has been starved of life, of purpose. It welcomes your probing like a void waiting to be filled. If you let it, it will evolve you. Just as the Emperor said. Your thoughts swirl with possibility. Your body strengthened, your mind bolstered, your very self expanded. 
all within your reach if you open your mind to the parasite. Oh God, I just don't know. I mean, we've got one dark worm and one white worm. We mix them up and we've got like a virtual yin and yang sign in our minds. That might be perfect balance. <sighs> Open your mind to a it. A coldness seeps through your veins as the tadpole <clears throat> awakens. It's yearning almost unbearable. Your mind is a veritable feast. Whoa. The tadpole's essence courses through you. Where it touches, your flesh, glands, organs contract and flood with pure thought. You feel different. Your body has never felt more connected. Your mind present in every flex of a joint or muscle. Right, well now at least she looks a little Perhaps like me. Once the others see what you can do, they will consider trying it for themselves. Oh, this, why do I feel this is such a bad idea? Both Toto and Lazel are now succumbed to the white worm. Oh God. Okay, um, we're gonna have to go to bed, sleep this off, and hope we wake up looking a little better in the morning. All right, we are done. Um, I'm gonna Maybe go just have a closer. quick chat with Shadowheart and make sure she still loves me, even though I look like so, death. So, there's been a mind flare inside the artifact, or astral prism, the whole time we've had it. Sounds like utter madness, even though I've seen it with my own eyes. The more I learn, the less I understand just why I was sent to retrieve that thing. But it matters little now. I do not serve Shah anymore nor the Mother Superior. The prism is no longer my mission. Saving my parents is. But I digress. Did you want something? Of course, I forgot. We we, we need to go save her parents. Uh, I want to talk about all this. Let's just, I just want to double, look at the state of me. I look like a zombie. I'll just make sure our relationship is still cool. Hang on, what's this? I think that special tadpole the Emperor offered would increase our chances of success. Let's see. The powers we already received have proved useful, true. But this is something different entirely. Do you know what this entails? Well, of course you do. But I don't want that for myself. Trust me, we need these powers. You're going to love what you can do with them. Oh, come on, let's do, let's in for a penny. In for a pound. Fine. I truly hope you're right about this. I've got no idea if I'm right about this. Oh, she's doing it as well. Oh, no. Oh, I'm so sorry. Life pulses from within. The parasite's thoughts whisper at the edge of your mind. It wants to share it. Okay, I get... Don't be afraid. I get the picture. It only wants to help you evolve. A coldness seeps through your veins as the tadpole awakens. It's yearning almost unbearable. The tadpole's essence courses through you. Where it touches, your flesh, glands, organs contract and flood with Wait a minute. thought. She's just you lost several feel teeth. Different. Your body has never felt more connected. Your mind present in Perhaps. Once the others see what you can do. Oh no, what am I doing? What am I doing? Okay, look, I'm gonna leave Astarian out of this. Then he may be our only hope. <laughs> oh dear, what have I done? Oh, leave Act 2. That was the end of Act 2. Now, I thought I'd reached that two episodes ago, but now we enter Act 3. The road to Baldur's Gate, potentially Baldur's Gate itself today. This would be, this would be so cool. We must now. find where Gortash and Orin have established themselves and take their nether stones. Well, at least that is still the story that we we, we already had. Uh-oh. Astarian. You're the only one. Oh, Shadowheart's letting off some, some steam out the back there. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Uh, Astarian, you're the only Baldur's one. Baldur's Gate is right over the hills. And so is Kazador. 
Cazador and his right of profane ascension. An imperious soiree, attended by devils and spawn alike. A grand ceremony to honor one exalted vampiric master. And elevate him to an unfathomable station. To place him in a position of such esteem. The world will yearn to kneel and offer their necks. God damn, you can see why he won the the best supporting actor award. But the, the the joystick awards just recently was it last well, this week actually. Thoroughly well deserved. Astarian, I you are a stallion. It sounds as if you envy him. Of course I envy him. Why wouldn't I? The problem with what Cazador has done is that he did it to me. <laughs> if the time comes and I can stay one move ahead of him, I'll take his place before his blood can hit the floor. So you'd kill to take that power from him? The others bound to the ritual? <laughs> What's a handful of the wretched servants? If they're anything like me when I was enslaved, they're all but begging for death anyway. After 200 years of shit, pure shit, I think I deserve something better. I think you're right. He really does. Look, freedom is not the same as power. Very true, a killer isn't worthy of respect. Or oh, all that matters to me is that you're safe. Gosh, I don't know. <sighs> all that matters is that you're safe, Astarian. You're one of us. Look, I appreciate that. I'm very grateful, of course. All I'm saying is, let's be clever about it. If an opportunity arises for me to become a more magnificent bastard than I already am, why turn it down? <laughs> let's find out more about the ritual before we waltz into Cazador's front door. If we track down my old comrades, the other spawn, we may discover more and be finely positioned for yours truly to ascend. Oh, I don't know about this, you know. Look, uh, d don't get ahead of yourself. We don't know if we don't know if it's possible for you to even usurp this ritual. We're going to Baldur's Gate, the city of one in a million chances, splendor and squalor. <laughs> Anything could happen. If we don't find my brethren, they'll find us, likely with bared fangs. We should get to them first. Then we can make their pretty tongues talk. Unless Cazador has changed their orders, they'll be in the dens of this town, seeking prey. So, anything can happen Thursday it is, then. So, Baldur's Gate awaits. Moving ahead. The city is close now. My former peers will be watching, no doubt. Waiting for my return. I mean, we've got an awful lot waiting for us. In Baldur's Gate, there what is just could help us. journal updated. Daughter of Darkness. I have to check the journal. So we've got a whole load of stuff here. The main quest: confront the Elder Brain, control it or destroy it. Whoever has control over the Nether Brain will hold unspeakable power. We could dominate it and have a thousand kingdoms at our command, or destroy the Nether Brain. It is too powerful to let live. Destroying it may be the smartest thing to do. I'm inclined to go with that option, to be honest, because no one should have control over unspeakable power. But we have Gortash, his nether stone. We've got to find his nether stones. I'm sure he keeps them somewhere in his nethers. Uh, and Orin, of course, who doesn't have the same kind of anatomical nethers as, as Gortash does, but I'm sure she's got a, a feisty pair of stones herself. Uh, gather your allies, though. Recruit allies in the fight against the cult. Freeing ourselves out... Uh, sorry, freeing ourselves of the parasite is proving more difficult than imagined. We should be on the lookout for powerful allies. Well, well hopefully they won't be disgusted by the way our eyes look right now. Free Orpheus. Kithrak Voss, a Githyanki knight, planned to meet someone at Sheres Keres. 
Who knows how to free Orpheus? We should look for answers there. Uh, help Kithrak Vosseroid. This is an option on the Gith Yankee story we could, we could follow. Uh, the Daughter of Darkness. We arrived in Worms Crossing. Shadowheart believes that Sharon looks lookout will be present in the vicinity awaiting her return. She must find one such lookout in order to learn where Sharon Cloister is hidden. She expects to find such a lookout hiding amongst the desperate new arrivals flooding into Worms Crossing. Uh, the Githyanki warrior Lazel is eager to speak with Kithrak Vos. Yep, the pale elf uh, Mystarion wants to basically destroy Kazador. And the Wizard of Water Deep. This one is about Gale, and I've just not followed that story. Help your protector is complete. The mind, the mind flayer revealed itself as none other than our dream visitor. It's a rogue illithid, and just like us, it wishes to be free of the Elder Brain's domination. By helping it to subdue the Githyanki Prince Orpheus, we remained protected from the Absolute's power. Oh, this is quite the story. And we have a way to go. Investigate Shares Caress. Okay, well, I, I guess we've got to try a lot of things. Okay, let me just grab a load of loot from... Oh, this is good. I've got to send some of these to other, other people because... Uh, Shadow Hunt, you have that one. Because I've got a load of healing potions and I know some of my friends don't have so many. Appreciably cared for boots. <laughs> what a wonderful name. Uh, okay, one more potion of healing. Staring, you can have that one. Okay, we're sharing the wealth. Let us go. This will be the first people we've spoken to since the realm. Oh, hello, little one. Um, excuse me. I can't find my mum. Well, good luck with that. Uh, all right, all right, all right. Side quest time. Where did you last see her? She was, um, she was sick. She had spots on her face and hands. She went to go get some herbs, and she was supposed to come back the same day. That was last ten day, though. Ten days ago. Okay, I don't know where your mum is, but have some money. <laughs> all right, look, you must be hungry. Take some food. Let's go find a guard. They'll be able to help you. It sounds like your mum is probably dead, mate. Look, let's find a guard. They'll be able to help. Guards blow like petards. They don't help us. Right. Okay, at least everybody approved of that. Um, you must be hungry, have some food. Oh, they all approved of that as well. Wow. Thanks. My mum would like this. She's the best cook in the world. And she taught me too. I'll, um... I'll look for her. I think she'll probably come soon. Thanks a lot. You're welcome, Yenna. Yenna, I thought when I first saw her was was a was a little girl, but I, uh, sorry, a little boy. But I think it's a little girl. Wow. I don't know what to do. There's just so much to explore. So many people. So many people. We've, oh, we've got a fast travel spot. I think we discovered yeah on the way in. That's good. We found Rivington. I'm riveted the thought of this. Fist Osmond, is that an order? Seems like a good moment to talk. Do you think that Osmond will mind if we give her a fisting? <laughs> Turn back, citizen. No passage in this direction. All right, I, I believe you, but, uh, but why not? It's bloodier than a butcher's backyard out there. Piles of dead absolutists and a few of our own as well. The cultists assaulted the gate, armed to the teeth trying to break in. They nearly had it too, before the Steel Watch intervened. Okay, Steel Watch. Is that some sort of fancy new rank of city watchman? <laughs> <laughs> A little more than that. You'll see for yourself soon enough if you head to the city. Oh god, I'm not sure. Oh, they're going to be mechanized soldiers or something. So what, we're not allowed up there? Is that what you're saying? I'm not allowed. I'm not allowed to see the carnage. Oh dear lord, there was a carnage. There's piles of meat. Okay, I, I take your word for it. Look, it's amazing how you can interact with so many different characters. So many unique lines of script recorded. All by individual voice actors. I've not heard a duplicate anywhere. Oh, where do I go? 
Where do I go? I mean, we've got so much to explore. I'm just going to do some of that precisely. Some exploring. Oh, what are they worried about? The refugees are seemingly scared by the look of us. Okay, we can't talk to these people. Fine. Be like that. Who is this? Seya Grotpol. I have to find out. No, we pay taxes for you to protect us, not these intruders. Come on, come on, talk, talk, talk. Darians, stand with me against this tide that threatens to overwhelm us. Please just go home. You're ruining a perfectly uneventful posting with this nonsense. The flaming fists are supposed to protect this good city, but they allow trash and vermin to take our homes and goods. Oh, another visitor, I see. Listen, we keep letting the likes of you in. Soon, there'll be no room left for any of us true Baldarians. It seems we've met Russell Brand in Baldur's Gate. This is kind of... <laughs> no disrespect, Russell. I love you, mate. Uh, just the way he looks. It's not really a, an opinion on, on your on your opinions. Uh, Baldurian. Baldur's Gate is the most diverse city in all of Faerun. We should take them in with pride. Oh, I love that. Isn't that very, very uh, accommodating and, and generous? Refugees aren't strays. They are people. I'll have you know I was born and bred here. I was, actually. It's, a, it's, it's my hometown. Uh, your accent's riving Tony, and that hardly counts. Not sure we should be debating who has more right to a place in Baldur's Gate than others. It is a diverse place, and we should take them in with pride. Another bleeding heart. Piss off, and take it elsewhere. Yeah, all right. I'll let your uh, your hairdresser know that you are due another appointment. A word. A word. And I'm sure the will deal with I just lost a wager, thanks to you. Who are you? Someone who bets that you'd never be foolish enough to actually show your face in this city again. But here you are. And the gold in my purse is soon to take flight. He reminds me of uh, a character from, from Star Wars uh, Rebels. What's his name? Oh. Anyway, you'll know. If you know Rebels, you know who I mean. Uh, uh, the Jedi, basically. Our hearts bleed for you, get to the point. Uh, you're a Sharon. Oh, he's a Sharon. Not a Karen. He's, <laughs> he's not going to make a scene. You're a Karen, aren't you? From Shadowheart's Cloister. There have been whispers about you, sister. About your faith. Your loyalty. Your company. I can't help but feel the strangest twinge of disgust as I look upon you. Is it true? Has Our Lady forsaken you? I think it's the other way around. She forsook us. Uh, reach out to her sci psionically. She should plead contrition for now. She has turned her back on your wretched goddess. Let Shadowheart handle. That is always the best option in any of these situations I've found. Shadowheart, speak your mind. I know the truth. I know my parents still live. Tell me where they are and I have no quarrel with you. I'm afraid the quarrel is unavoidable, thanks to you. Now I must report your reappearance. If you are intent on bringing matters to a head, then seek out the House of Grief in the Lower City. Though if I was you, I'd be very tempted to just forget it all and disappear. You have some form of doing so, after all. Oh, I don't know what to do next. Why is she smoking hot? She's so smoking hot. We found a Sharon lookout called Ferg Droger. He revealed that the cloister is a hit is hidden in a in a place called the House of Grief, in the lower city of Baldur's Gate. So there is at least one place we can journey to. How how much of this can't really see? That's the Sharess caress, where we can talk about the Githyanki side of things. The daughter of darkness. See, it it shows me this, but we have to get to the lower part of Baldur's Gate to continue Shadowheart's story here. 
Let's press forward. There may be some more friendly people we can talk to. Dandy Thistle Petal. Oh, to be fair, for a miserable collection of shabby hovels jam-packed with wretched refugees, this place isn't bad at all. <laughs> I'm just overwhelmed that we've now finally reached Baldur's Gate. Tinker Nazim. And it's going to be a lot of conversation again today. We're going to be meeting a lot of new people. Heads will roll for this. This, this transgression. This injustice. What the hell happened? I know the way they treat refugees around here is terrible. I don't give a shit about all that. Okay. It's how I've been treated, which is the real Oh, travesty. never mind everyone else. A perfectly respectable businessman wants to bring his, well, business into this fine city. And what do they do? Let me guess. They didn't want it. Uh, we'll just let him continue ranting. They talk some absolute horse bollocks about papers and correct filing procedures and threw me in this slam. I should be loins deep in Charesse's caress by now, <laughs> not waddling about in filth. All right, I know why you came to the big city, little boy. Never mind, I'm sure you'll get your balls deep in Charesse's caress another time. Not today. So this is the refugee camp. All right, maybe we'll come here for uh, 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 a visit another time, but I get the point. The, the refugees are kept outside the city in rather slum-like conditions. But we have more to explore. Uh, a dead chicken. Now that is not something I thought we would find here, but there is more to this. What is going on up here? Why all the Anything dead chickens? Oh, and we can't harvest the meat off them. That is disgusting game. How dare you. Right. Let's talk to Zephy Softbutt. Oh, Soft Bluff. <laughs> about what happened to the dead chickens, hopefully. We got here first, friend. You're welcome to whatever scraps we leave behind. Okay, so no, no, no joy. Slami, any words? Any wise words if from you? If you're here to fill an empty stomach, look elsewhere. Folks swarmed what little was odd, stuff in their pockets. Bloody animals. Right, so the cart toppled, right? I'm guessing the cart crashed, everybody helped themselves. A couple of chickens lost their lives in the struggle. <laughs> uh, and that's that. I'm sad, sadly, is that. All right, well, I guess we'll press on. Oh, hang on, what do we got here? A couple having a lovely picnic. Looking over the refugee camp. Enjoying their luxurious picnic. Fine day for it, eh? Got to enjoy things while they last, I suppose. We just succeeded a survival trap. So there's a trap around here somewhere. I don't quite know what... I don't quite know what that's about. As, uh... Just to try to fit in, use some of the accents I've heard from here. I think it's about time we. Ooh. Circus oh, circus post. Put my hands on everything. Put my hands on everything. Yeah, I am actually trying to put my hands on everything. A the circus, circus post. of the last days has returned. See Dryad's gin and Dribbles the clown back with a new act. Okay, hang on. Something just happened to the elder brain. Spoke at the same time. What's happened to the Elder Brain and what do we do about it? Where are we supposed to go to to check out this? This is a beautiful city. There's so much to see. I, I'm i going to have to get into the thick of things. We need to find out more. Toto succeeded a perception check somehow. He's, around, he's over there somewhere. I'm not paying attention. Oh, there, there they are. I got you. Sword Coast Couriers. Orders are orders. We've got ours and you got yours. Step away. Ooh. There must be something. That will make a great headline. Okay, this feels like, because the, the game's done a quick save here, um, I'm going to take my very own. <clears throat> Sorry, auto save. I'm taking the quick save. So we've got to find out what's going on here. Fist Kepso. Again, these, these, are, these are not orders, no matter how much they ask you. Our readers will be outraged. Take it somewhere else. My hands are full. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Handfuls from the inside of somebody else's. Oh, <clears throat> Damn 
if you know what I'm saying. Swarm in the place. Interesting face tattoos there. Now, do we speak to the Steel Watcher? Is this where we actually have to head? It is. We've got to proceed. We've got to proceed through this gate somehow. Ooh. Oh, here we go. Halt! By orders of Lord Gortash, refugees are no longer allowed in the city. Turn around. Do I look like a refugee? Actually, with this face, yeah, I'm sure I do. In fact, we all look a little rough around the edges. Uh, but I am not a refugee. I have urgent business in the city. You have no idea who you're talking to. Let me through or I'll kill you. No, threats aren't going to be good. There's a giant robot and she's got a very massive Thor-like hammer strapped to her back. We're not going to we're not going to pick a fight unless unless we really have to. But I am no refugee. Well, do you have the means to support yourself? What, 200 coin? Ha! Huh. <laughs> Pocket change, my dear, pocket change. Right. Article 30.1.5 of the Council's decree on extraordinary wartime measures. I am confiscating that. The city thanks you for your contribution. Your name? My my name is Toto. Uh, I'm called Daisy Dewdrop Fluffington. Oh, that's good, that's good, but no, I'm not going to... I need to ask why you need my name. I'm doing the questioning here. Oh, we ask Last the question. time. Sorry, sorry, name? sorry. <laughs> All right, my name is Tata. Well met, citizen. Your parasite stirs. From the construct, you feel connection, resonance. Okay, what the hell is that giant metal thing? I am a steel watcher, citizen. Here to serve the people of Baldur's Gate. In the name of Lord Enver Gortash. Oh, State Gortash. Your business. Gortash is the guy, one of the guys we need to remove his nether, nether regions. A uh, little bit of loose armor there. That's, that's a suggestive of a chink, but this is also the steel guardian thing that, that we, they spoke about uh, at, at the gates there, where there was this horrible bloodbath. Uh, a couple of conversations back, if you remember. Um, my business, my business. Baldur's Gate is my city, my home. Or we can go with a sorcery deception-y type role. I suspect the source of my limitless arcane power resides in this city. Do we? Do we? Should we? I think it's better that it's got a better chance than the Baldurian. Let's go with it. Oh, well, it's, do you know what? I think we're going to nail this. We've already got a 9 to 12, If even if we roll a 1. Only that will reveal a critical failure. There we go. We're good. We're good. Uh huh. Eyes open. Body still. Oh, what's it doing? Laying a metal egg or something? Do do as she says and stand still. Uh, yeah. Go on then. Behind the watcher's gaze, a presence awakens. You are seen. You are known. Your party's prior transgressions are reflected in its stare, as witnessed by the cult's ever alert, scrying eyes. It oh has God. seen the deep shadows of Grimforge and the stone floors left bloodied. I Watchers think we might be in trouble. Directly into your mind with a voice like poisoned honey. You are marked for special treatment, not simply an enemy of the people. But an enemy of the absolute. Come quietly, or die. Oh no. Uh, consent to arrest or ready yourself for a fight. Marked for special treatment. What do I do? Submit or fight, which will lead to a better result here. Oh boy. Oh, I don't know what to do. I, at least I've taken a quick save, so no matter what happens here, we can come back and try again. An enemy of the absolute. Come quietly or die. I don't want to be arrested. I know what it's like in these prisons. We're going to fight. Halt, citizen. Submit to inspection. In the name of Lord Enver Gortash. We've, we've just kind of been through this. The he parasite wanted to fight reels me. in your skull. Something within the Steel Watcher tugs at your mind. Hmm. I... Oh, this is a Jedi mind trick. Potential here. 
I am a law abiding citizen. We are not the droids you are looking for. And free to go. Oh, we've already got that. Okay. Gotta get a 20. Ain't happening. I kind of knew that would happen. Uh, it's a 20 is difficult. We've got one inspiration. I think I'll save it. Forget Your it. Your trial is complete, villain. And the sentence is imprisonment. Please comply. I will not. We're going to fight. Let's go. Oh, God. This may be a bad idea. How much damage does this thing have? 200 damage. Critical miss on my group there, although they were persistent. Okay, I think I've made a mistake. <laughs> yeah. Outraged. Look at that. Unfortunately, my group were, were, were grouped together, quite literally. Uh, and Astarian is already nearly dead. Front page me. You wanted this, not me. No, I'm not too bad with the uh, the melee. That's decent, but he's about to hit us with an arrow. Snare that. Can we survive this? It's it, we're basically on about as much health. No, we're dead. What are you doing? We cannot defeat the brain without that stone. All right, look, look let me let me cut to the chase here. I died. Okay, I'm going to separate duties. I heard the stories. Let's get people in different orders here. We're going to go with the crown, the king, the crown. The, there's the king, my avatar. There's a, a journalist over here I feel like I should be talking to because I keep waving and doing things. Aren't you? I knew there was a story here. And there you are, the hero of the hour, walking right up to me. The name's Lens. Reporter with the Boulder's Mouth Gazette. Care to do a quick interview? Why Why not? Yeah, sure. Um, uh, I've got urgent business, but carry I on. I dream of keeping you from it. So, you've arrived at Baldur's Gate. What's brought you here at a time like this? I've come to save the city. You have? <laughs> I thought our soon-to-be Lord Gortash had things in hand. I'm sure he's got Though, something in his if hand. If anyone could help him, it would be you. You've got a knack for finding chinks in the Absolute's armor. My sources tell me you recently vanquished the fearsome General Ketherick Thorne. How did you manage that? Charm and sheer personality. Uh, how in the hells do you know about that? I fought with everything I had. He was formidable foe, wielding terrible power. Formidable? You're just being modest. I heard you swatted him aside like a fly from a corpse. Yep, true. You'll deal with the remaining absolutists in much the same way, I suppose. The cult's threat is far from extinguished. What's your plan of attack? Well, basically, I've got to try and beat this guardian at the city gates and help all the uh, refugees get sanctuary. What makes you think I'm planning on attacking them? I don't imagine they'll give you much choice after you killed their general. Better to be on the front foot, surely. Oh, this is a good point. You must have some strategy in mind. I hope I'm not going to get quoted too carefully in this news article. Um, I'm on. I, uh, I'm going to cut that rotten cult off at the head. Well. Not much of a planner, more of an improviser. That is me all over. You think chaos courses through your veins? You have no idea. Oh, who are you? Who are you? You're... Oh, I knew you weren't who you... Oh, I thought... I bet this is... What's his name? Oh, dear Lord, it's her. No, 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 no. Sir? You're the lickspittle who crushed the Bone Lord's thrall. Uh oh. <laughs> I know the truth. <laughs> you come for our nether stones. Come to prize one from the tyrant's death grip. Pluck the other from my rotted carcass. <laughs> when you find the Lordling, tell him. Orin is watching. Oh, Orin, I'm looking forward to seeing you again. All right, well, um, uh, quick saving right now. Orin is a shapeshifter. Well, yes, I, I suppose she is. Now, I need to I need to position my crew uh, ready for this fight because because uh, it's going to happen, basically, isn't it? It's going to happen. Refugees. Um, Lizelle, Lizelle, where can we put you? I don't know if I put you right in the middle of things. Sir, you need to stay. Let's get you uh, front and center. Astarian, we need you in a position of archery. But if I get 
Over here, you're in trouble. Um, Let's be quick. Can I move you here and 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 any way around this place? No, no. It's it's a bloody great big bridge. It ain't happening. I don't suppose I can get you to jump up here, can I? Nope. Too high. Didn't think so. Um, what about on the bench? No, you can't even jump on top of a bench. Or the up there. Ravengard, I think. I heard okay, well, man. forget that then. Shadowheart. Um, Shadowheart, step just... into the middle. We're going to give we our friends a little For blessing the the before we begin. Our. Nice. And sanctuary thyself. Beautifully done. Okay. Are we ready? Are we ready? No, we're not. Who am I going to sacrifice? I think I'm going to put Shadowheart in this conversation because she will be the one who they won't attack. Let's go. Halt! All right, it's the By same conversation. Lord, Lord I'm not a refugee. Blah 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 yourself? blah. Right. Here, have some cash. Um, I'm Daisy Dewdrop Fluffington. Well met, citizen. Fluffington. <laughs> Your parasite stirs. From the construct, you feel connection. Not just yet. Okay, State I can't business. go. Sure, yep, sure, whatever. Um, Baldur's Gate's my home. I uh -huh. don't think this matters. Eyes open, body still. Okay. Why? Do as she says, stand still. All right, go Behind on. Behind the watcher's gaze of your party. It it's see only going to scan me and tell me I'm smart for treatment. treatment. Yes, ready not yourself for a enemy. fight. I'm not going quietly. Now, you shouldn't attack me. The Starion's ensnared, but that's okay. He's got range. Oh, look at this. The Starion is the first man required. Now, what I really want to do is get rid of this. This is the one that caused the problems because they were the healer. So let's just try. Okay, a good start. A 15 hit on their healer. Can I bite this one? I'm going to bite. I can't. I can't. I'm ensnared. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Let's uh, just have a little healage. Talk to me. Okay, Shadowheart. Um... I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say, nor what to do here. Who's coming up next? It's going to be Toto, and the Wall of Fire would be really good here. Hmm. I'm going to miss the step you backwards. Let's just get you back over here. Um, and a couple of Banes wouldn't hurt. Or oh, it should hurt them, if it's possible. Actually, I can't hit anybody else. Damn it. All right, well, two will do. They're both baned. Nice. End your turn. All that matters. Right. Flamage. Time to join the fray, Toto. Get yourself in the middle. And burn, baby. Burn. Oh, that's good. That is good. Okay, that's a, a fairly good start. I mean, that wall will stay as long as I can concentrate on it. I need to oh, maybe just take a side step. End the turn. Lazelle. Lazelle, I don't want to do too much with you to get you involved in the flames. Let's just use a little archery. It's going to have to do for now. A miss. Oh, what happened there? I'm not sure. We got a critical miss. That was a weird bit of animation there. Can we miss the step you backwards just a touch? Oh, there's another guy right behind us. I didn't see this guy. Not cool. Oh, damn it. And I can't travel. Oh, I can travel. My path be true. I'm gonna. I'm going to try and take out an archer. The archers are a pain. Mm. It, it'll, it'll do. Evasive footwork. Lazelle. Okay. 
When they spawn in the flames, they should... What? Oh, my concentration's been broken. You dick. Ouch. Concentrating on Toto entirely here. This is not cool. Okay, we are losing heavily. Counter. Can't have them healed. It didn't work. They got healed. We're screwed here. This is so bad. <sighs> right, my turn for the healing then. Everybody, uh, the other mage can heal so much better than I can. I take it I'm still sanctuary. Am I? No, I'm not. What happened there? No idea. Bane it is. You, you, and you. This feels good. Okay, Starion. Oh, boy. You're on your own up against this guy. Immune to psychic damage. Well, never mind. Try that. Missed. Great. I won't give it. Okay, how about a little fireball? Oh, that's good. This one at the back's got to go. You're the one I want. Ooh, ooh, ooh. But that's not going to help here. I'm going to have to hit somebody right next to me. It's time to strike. Lazal, please just take out somebody. Oh, come on. Not good enough. Oh, this is terrible. Invasive footwork once again. Look at this. Toto is absolutely surrounded here. Good hit, Lazelle. Oh, I've got this. This guy's nearly done. Counter it. God damn it. Still, look at that. They all healed again. Shield blow, but I don't know if that really did anything. on Astaria. We are in serious trouble. This is the one that's got to go. This lady right here. Astarian, all you can do is try and take him, man. Try and take him. I'm immobile. Phenomenal. Ten damage. I'll take it. Heal up a little bit and go again. Okay, it's good. It's good. At least we are all still alive. What else can I do here? Glyph of Warding. Now, this could be interesting. Bit of lightning damage. Hmm. Really want to get that lady at the back. This is going to hurt Toto as well. Oh, yes. Okay, that's good, that's good. I mean, I know Toto took a hit there, my way. but that isn't such a big problem. Uh, well, it is kind of, but it's better than... Uh, right, fireballs. Bit of lightning, bit of fireballs. Let's do it. Nice. She is nearly gone. She is nearly gone. Oh. I'm gonna have to let it roll. I am death. Yeah, come on. Come on. 
one out of the way. Can you reach this one? Can you even touch her? Not enough movement. Ah! A dash. Oh, evasive footwork. That's no good. I don't want to do that again. Try a ranged attack on this one. 50% chance. Yeah, baby. She's gone. All right, all right. This might well help. This might well work. Uh... I'm going to bring up the, the the mage hand here. Can I get it near something to throw? Can I throw a javelin? I could throw a javelin. It's mage hand over there. Might work. Toto, nearly out. Can't take another hit. Shield blow. I don't know what that does. It doesn't seem to do much. But they cannot be healed anymore, so we're, 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 we're looking good. The, the Steel Watcher, though, he's... <laughs> yeah, not so good. Oh, god damn it. Astarian's knocked Impulse to the ground. Impulse. Missed on Shadowheart. And another miss on Shadowheart. Oh, yeah, you beauty. Right, what can we do here? I think... Oh, I've got to heal again. I've got to heal everybody. Do it. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Spirit Guardians. Call for spirits protect you. Level 3. Do it. Nice. That will buy me a little time. Poor old Astarian. What the hell can he do? Shocking Grasp. Let's try it. This guy's got armor. Yes, 26 damage. Not bad, man. Not bad at all. Okay, uh, that's your last healing potion. I think I've got some more in the back pocket, but that'll do. Yes, it is. Okay, time for a twinned spell. We will use Firebolt on these two. Critical hits. And another one down. All right, all right. Maybe we got something here. More healing. Lazelle, can you reach it? Or are we going to go for this guy? Are we going to go for a main hand attack? I think we have to. Oh, come on. No way. I'm gutted by that. That is disgusting. Oh, oh, got him on the retaliation hit. Nicely done. Well, my, my shocking grippy thing. Uh, can I pick something up? Right, let me see. Uh, throw. What can I throw? Too heavy to throw that person. Oh, I thought I'd be able to throw, like, something on the ground. Well, what's the point of this, then? Unarmed strike. All right, unarmed strike that, baby. Not quite sure that did much, but it was at least better than nothing. We shove it, shove it. All right, there's an archer back here as well. Starion is not down and dead yet. Do I want a missile snare? Hell yes. Zero effect on that. Five damage on that. Hey, we might be all right here. We've got two enemies left. Obviously the big guy. The big guy's the problem. Shadowheart, Shadowheart, what can we do with you? Concentrated Blast. I must be concentrating on another spell, which I am, because I've got the spirit... Or am I? Or is that... Count? That counts as a condition. Oh, I don't know. Am I concentrating? It's a conjuration. Oh, it doesn't count. Oh, I don't know what to do. Uh, Sacred Flame... The choices are frustrating. All right, Sacred Flame, this biatch. No, that's only a 6% chance. 65% chance with this. That was a 16. I'll take it. I will take it. Uh, in case yourself with shimmering field of magic that increases your armor. No, I'm not going to do it. <sighs> I don't think we need to do anything else. A statue. I would love to get you out of here, um, but we're going to shock and grasp again because it was relatively effective. That's, that's 
all right, better than I was hoping for. Disengage, disengage, and we'll come over and take out the archer. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, I can't even catch my breath. All right, sunshine. What do we got? Some level twos. Yeah, it's got to be. It's got to be. Right. You can have all of them. Ah, oh, they were low dice rolls, you evil I game. Me. I am death. You are evil. You are death. Come on. Oh, come on. That's a little better. I'm going to mark her. She seems to be the only one that can do the real damage. All right. Bring it on. Critical miss on Lazelle, you loser. Snared the arrow. Uh, there, all right, the second one hurt. Starion. What can we do? What can we do? Can we even get close? Not enough movement. What about with a little bonus dash? Them. Oh, I'm coming. Okay, that's better. That is Can't better. Fighting. Shadow Heart. We've been quite disappointed with your uh, melee skills, and we've got no more spells to heal anybody, so we've got to go all out attack. Let's try the Guiding Bolt again. 20 damage. All right, all right. She's still got the shields. Fight. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. But what are we going to go with? Can't use the Ice Storm. Burning Hands would be good. Firebolt, shall we? Twin the Firebolt. Let's do it. One for you. And one for you. Alright. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's going on? Okay, there's a red circle around him, and he, he's going to explode, isn't he? Oh, dear lord. Right, we've got to get out of here. Uh, we need our friends to move. Yeah, there's L. Uh, God damn it. Get Yankee jump your ass out of here. Do it, do it, do it over here. Over here. Ah, oh, why not? What's, what's wrong? Why can't she do it? She's, she's trapped. Oh, she's immobile. How did that happen? Can she survive the explosion of this thing? I don't think evasive footwork is going to help. I don't suppose I can shut this thing either. No, too heavy. All right, well, I'll take my chances with a heal. And hope for the best. And it's blown. Shatterheart's down. Okay, but that's okay. We're all the, I can't believe the rest of my crew are actually still alive. I lost two of them in the in the in the first fight. All right, Starion, I could get over there, but she's already had one saving throw. Let me try this and stab him in the back. It's good. It's good. How about a little bite in the neck as well? Oh, very nice. Oh, that guy's lost. Breathing. There's no Despite way he can everything. survive. But we do need to help her up. Ah. Lazelle could do that. If I can end this guy's... ...existence. Torment. And it's done. Alright, we got we got it done. Um, somebody, for the love of God, Flag help up Shadowheart, please. There we go! The crew is saved. My God, that was difficult. Transfuse health, what's this? Sacrifice half your remaining hit points to heal a target for the same amount. Oh, I've never done that before. My injuries need tending. Yeah, everybody's injuries need tending. We are not doing well. I can't believe we got through it. So we got through the gates. Uh, the south span checkpoint is done. What does it mean? Like, have we been able to rescue the I'm going to quick save here before we get through the gate in case something terrible happens when we do. Efficient path. 
I know I've got to rest. I'm going to short rest everybody. To get that health back a little bit. Somebody is waiting for us. A short citizen. I don't think it matters much. Oh, we've got guards up on the... Oh, I've got to group everyone together, haven't I? Group. 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 Alright, I should join Mazel. Crack and Relia. Let's have a word with Crack. I heard he's good fun. The missus and I have been dreaming about the city. No more sleeping rough. Didn't expect to find it locked down tighter than a watcher's fist. Well, that didn't really do much for me. So we've got a lot of exploring to do. Um, the place is relatively safe. We've got some guards around here, but I don't suppose they care what happened on the bridge. That's really, really weird. Like, why should they care? Should they care? Who knows? Guys, we made it to Baldur's Gate. There's a lot of exploring to do. And we got through our first challenge. Oh, hang on a minute. We've got a fast travel spot. Reveal the south span of Worms Crossing. This place is ours. We own it. Guys, thanks for watching. We're through. But before we go, Relia, can you help? Looking for lodgings? Don't bother. All the decent places are gone. Damned coronation. Yeah, it was really quite a disappointing end. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in yeah. the next part. Take care, all the best, and good night. Also has we are not staying in a brothel.